what are tied under a rope right. by a devil. You just don't identify your gift. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see, David identified his gift. His career was a shepherd. His father put him to be a shepherd. All his brothers went to the military. Mm -hmm. All of them. He was the only guy who was just at home watching sheep that was not even considered by his father. Yeah. He discovered his gift as a warrior, mm. killing bears and lions. By the time he got Goliath, he was shining. He was like, I've been here before. This is nothing. <laughs> so you could already tell it was not the anointing that made him a warrior. His gift. Wow. You're not listening to We're me. Listening. His gift is what put him before Goliath. Mm. The anointing just put him on the throne. Mm. Wow. You see, the anointing of God is supposed to support your gift. Right. Mm. That your gift will be unique and separated because of the power of God backing you. Mm. But the skill of the gift is inherent. Mm. You just improve on it. So David, when they were singing songs with Saul, David killed, a, a, a soul killed a thousand. David killed 10,000. They were not singing wrong because Saul was not a warrior. Yeah. He did go to war, but he had no warrior background. He was a child. His father was wealthy. He was supervising his father's thing, but he was not a warrior by trade. Mm -hmm. David had the heart of a fighter. When nobody could see him, he was already fighting. He was already winning wars. He never lost a single battle. 66 mm. battles, never lost a single one. David never lost a war wow. in his life, never. Mm. His passion was worship. <laughs> mm. His passion was play, playing the harp, singing until the anointing drops. His gift was being a warrior. Wow. Uh. is being a military leader, was being a born leader. But when his leading skills were in play, he was in the bush watching goats and sheep. Wow. 